Hello everybody, welcome to Impressive Image Maker channel. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I am a photographer. I shot this image for a couple years ago for her 20th anniversary photograph while shooting and uh, I shot a lot of uh, fur figure to close up headshot type stuff and uh, this is today's subject and uh, I got this image and also I made this pencil drawing type image by Adobe Photoshop used filter called find edges and I'm gonna use these two images to get something interesting something well hopefully impressive image well let's get started let's check change this blend mode on this pencil drawing type image well I got <clears throat> this is nice lighten well, let's see overall image no I'm interested in um, color pencil type restoration these days and uh, I like this kind of pastel colors so this lighting is pretty interesting well overlay pretty much contrast but let's not see around eyes overall luminosity this pastel color is pretty yeah nice for me I think it's nice looking good we got this pencil drawing type image too well I'm gonna use this luminosity image and also overlay this contrast on her eyes yeah let's get this luminosity image first and uh, well I'm gonna make group then duplicate this group now flatten this image and we got this image as a base and uh, this is a little bit thin maybe so okay i'm gonna duplicate this layer then uh, let's see if i change this one more to multiply it goes a little bit dark too much so i'm gonna go down about maybe 60 percent Okay, I'm gonna march down. Now I got this base image here. Then let's see. Okay, turn it off to keep it. Now this new group, I had overlay this contrast, huh? Eyes around, maybe about obies, kimonos, stuff. Well, I may use this, so I'm gonna uh, fix this image. Okay, again, this is one group I changed overlay, blend mode overlay. So I'm gonna duplicate this layer, and then flatten this image. So we got two images: this overlay effect image and also luminosity effect image. Okay, I'm gonna rename overlay effect image, right? luminosity effect image now two images then I'm gonna break down this group bring this one out to group then I'm going to delete this order so we got four images now right okay from here now I'm gonna turn it off this well let's see I want to add some color on background and also let me move these layers. I want this overlay effect, pre-contrast and pre-saturated color. This one move up to all the way top. Now then turn it off right now. Now this is a luminosity effect and uh, I may use this pencil drawing type image now it's overlay bring back to normal blend mode 
then I may use as a pencil drawing type just drawing maybe change the blend mode to darken on something so we see it through underneath of the layers so I'm gonna just leave it darken and move all the way up okay now turn it off now I only see this base image of the original photo well just check this uh, luminosity image now this is pretty nice already illustration image huh okay I'm gonna make mask then if I mask this image base image is gonna show up right so just I'm gonna tap chap later but I just want to see well let's see what brush should I use? Okay, go from airbrushing to soft blend. Now mask this luminosity effect layer. Change brush, soft blend to soft brush. This is much more softer. Okay, now what's next? Okay, I want to see this overlay effect again I'm gonna make mask then now I'm gonna invert this mask then I let's see let me see if I turn it on this how it's gonna look like now it's reveal this mask so use the white then same place this eyes Let's see what's going to happen. Now combine some with this overlay effect layer and uh, this pencil drawing and well, luminosity effect layer. Some. I can't tell how much. I just want to look at it. Then you choose how much you want this image to be show up, right? Okay, so that's kind of confusing, but well, we see this image so. Okay, now maybe some part of this kimono, back of the kimono, so I'm gonna go reveal this. I'm going wish color of the kimono and flower on her hair. And I'm gonna touch up well all the images I think. Just smudging, use a smudge tool. Well involves fine I think. Okay now over effect. Luminosity effect. Yeah. It'll take out these grains and stuff. Just smooth it out. Skins. Well, touch up and smooth out and uh, take out these hairs and stuff from Amish. So overall, just so far, this is base Amish. Then I got luminosity effect layer. This is the base and mask it this part face then add some overlay effect layer like up the flower on her hair and also the face okay so far that's it now 
Now let me see if I can add some colors on background. Okay, add layer. Then use that brush, some kind of dry media type image, like a chalk. Sketching to Bonavo chalk. Let's see. Well, background, normal blend, this much, real saddle blue and green overall. Since the subject model has a lot of red in it, so, well, about her hair, it's kind of, uh, look, looks like hard wire type. So I want to show this as a little bit more soft image. Hmm, look at this here on um, overlay effect. This part is pretty nice. Okay, and this mask, this luminosity effect layer to show the original image, which is a little more like image, I hope. Yeah, it becomes a little bit soft. Okay, so far, let me see, just reveal this mask to make lighter, lighten up around here. So it's gonna hide some hairs around here too. Let me try. Some part, some around here too. Okay, how is it now? Soft touch. This is it for today. And uh, well, I got this image. Overall, luminosity effect layer, which is this illustration type image. And I got soft image from base original Im image with this mask. Like a hair and some of a face, opacity, density, and uh, I got some part from overlay effect, this part, like her uh, eyes and uh, flower on her hair. And I add this some um, background color, just a real shallow green and blue, since she's got uh, reddish warm tone base so I add some cold colors on background now I'm gonna change this pencil drawing type image one more to let's see and overlay and the luminosity effect layers already so I don't need any effect from this pencil drawing type image. We got lines, everything on these two layers already. So I don't use this. Well, I guess that's it for today. And uh, thank you for watching my video. I really appreciate for you guys' support. And I hope this movie is going to give you some kind of idea for your creative work like a combination of the original image to effective layers like overlay and luminosity type. Well, that's good. You guys have a nice day and uh, see you next time. Bye now. Ciao.